Hi everybody, welcome to the final video of the Catapult Project, the one where we are going to show you how to put it to the test. We're going to walk you through this process step by step and help make sure you're following all of the specifications along the way. So let's dive right into it. For this demonstration, we used the catapult that we showed you how to make at the end of the last video, but we made it a little bit stronger and cooler looking. For our choice of ammo, we tried cutting in half a ping pong ball and filling it up with foil before finally taping it all together, and it ended up working out pretty good. The next step is to place your target, and you can pretty much do this however you like. You can lay it flat on the ground, against a wall, or lean it, which is what we ended up doing. You can also change the height of it if you think that could help your accuracy. Now it's time to have some fun and get to launching. You may want to start nice and close and gradually work your way back as you hit the target. But for this video, we figured you wouldn't want to see some of those shorter launches, and we figured we'd show you some good launch techniques. I tried warning you that it's pretty hard to build an accurate catapult, so don't get frustrated if you find yourself missing the target a lot. Try to make the necessary adjustments, like angling the catapult or even moving the target. But stay persistent because it's going to be worth it once you hit it. We finally had an attempt from a pretty far distance that hit the target, and boy was that satisfying. Whether you have a tape measure or you'd rather walk it out by foot, make sure you have a way to document your achievement and the distance you fire from because it's really something to be proud of. So it's really not too complicated of a process, but like we said earlier, we know this project can be a little bit of a tricky one. So please take advantage of our Zoom calls that we host in case any questions pop up along the way. We'd love to help you out there. Also remember to upload your finished project to that file upload tab on our project page. Once we see you've turned something into us, we're going to get going on your snazzy feedback report. And who knows, you may even be eligible for one of our cool prizes this month. So thanks again for tuning in. We can't wait to see what everybody comes up with. We hope you have a great rest of your month. Thank you again, everybody.